So that starts the cooking process. Why is that also important? Salt and pepper. And he's going to, Bob is going to put... At the end of the day, McDonald's is a burger company. And, and for us, uh, there's no more uh, important place to really focus on in improving uh, the quality of our food than starting with the burger. A lot of the innovation that they've been doing has been working on the perception, if nothing else, of trying to make it easier and make better decisions at McDonald's. So in listening to the voice of our customer, we knew that we needed to deliver a better burger experience for them. Over to the prep line, and all of a sudden We've been able to change perceptions not only around our burgers, but on our, on our overall menu and brand as well. When you look at their menu and, and the changes they're making, certainly in the back of their mind, they're still selling burgers and fries, but they're trying to make it easier for families and kids and moms to make that decision to go to McDonald's and feel a little bit better about it. Well, I think they're playing catch up because if, if you look at the operational aspect of bringing in fresh beef, it's really challenging, especially for a, a restaurant chain as large as McDonald's, $37 billion in total sales. And so uh, it's certainly a lot easier for small players to do fresh beef. The operational and logistic aspects of, of bringing fresh beef in and, and really the way that the McDonald's kitchens have been designed over time. Uh, just really lead uh, you know to kind of a wholesale operational mindset change. So McDonald's tested at over 400 restaurants in Oklahoma and Texas. Uh, it went very well. The chain noted that they saw a lift in customer count and traffic uh, and so that's something that they're counting on for the the, the broader system. In terms of the taste of, of fresh versus frozen burgers, I think some consumers will tell you that they can taste the difference, uh, but I think it is subjective, and sometimes I think it's, it's more in the consumer's minds than anything. Clearly the consumers want it and they're demanding it. Okay. Va a ser para comer aquí, ¿verdad, señor?